standing in, Brian Reynolds. He will lead this one off today. Leading off the afternoon for Pittsburgh, the center fielder, Brian Reynolds. First pitch of the at bat. Lower part of the zone, but it's taken for a strike. Line drive, base hit. With that, the Buccos have their leadoff man aboard to kick off the inning. That is second. The second baseman, Kevin Newman. Into the box, Kevin Newman. And she'll take a look at ball one. Reynolds on at first, nobody out. Now a big fastball, and he's well behind it with the swing. Gaussman uses a split finger fastball as one of his weapons of choice in the arsenal. He can really be very deceptive when that pitch is working, and I'd imagine as a hitter, it's always in the back of your mind. Made him look silly with that one. Swing and a miss on the slider, and that's out number one. Here's Gregory Polanco. First swings for him in this one, with the runner still at first and one gone. Gregory Polanco. It comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Dog got him reaching a bit too far after that one. It's strike one. Played an in, hits a ball and a strike. As a veteran out on the mound, that's a pitch that you expect to get a call on. Got to believe he keeps pounding that spot until he builds a rapport with the umpire. And he turns on this one and yanks it foul and back out of play. The one-two is looked at for ball number two. Misses and it's going to set up a big pitch now. Three and two. Well, a three-two count and a guy that handles the bat up at the plate. This is a great time to put that runner on first in motion. Offered at and missed. Here's the throw, and he is out at second. Caught stealing to end the inning. Here's the right fielder Hunter Pence. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The right fielder Hunter. The pitch. No balls in one strike. The wind up and the 0 1. Fooled with the curveball there, and it's strike two. He obviously found a great feel for that breaking ball while warming up before the game. Leadoff hitter getting two curveballs is usually not the norm. And a good bite to that slider as he swings through it for the first out of the inning. Coming to the plate now, Mike Yastrzemski. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Ooh, started him with the change, and it's nothing in one. Back-to-back -back strikeouts in the first right here. Pitcher is setting a tone pound in the zone. Driven nicely into the gap. Through first and hustling for second. Arms pumping. He's hustling for third. The relay. And it's in time as he's out at third as the good relay gets him. That is third. The center fielder. Mitch Hanniger. Stepping in now is Mitch Hanniger. As the first pitch to him is off the plate for a ball 1-0. Looking to get on base and keep this first inning alive. Line shot to third, and the side is retired. All set for the start of the inning, and next to bat will be the first baseman, Josh Bell. Now here's the pitch. Swung on and missed for the first strike. Popped him up. Posey is there. 
Makes the play one away. Now at the play, Trey Mancini. Trey Mancini. First offering on its way. Goes the other way and sends it deep down the right field line. Up into the arcade and out of here. That is good. The third base. So that'll bring up Jonathan Scope. Jonathan. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. A ball and a strike. Bases are empty, one man out. On that fastball's too much for him there, one and two. It's not easy to get your barrel to a pitch that high. That can be an effective location as long as he keeps it above the letters. Hit to third. And there are two away now. So here's Adam Frazier. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. Here comes the first pitch. And a fastball is in there for strike one. Well executed fastball right at the knees. Going to be a long day for this offense if he stays in that spot. Swing and a miss and he's quickly in the hole 0-2. Two mid-90s fastballs right there that he doesn't seem to think he can catch up to. I wouldn't be shocked if he came right at him again with another good one. Got him swinging in the dirt. Posey's got it. And that ends the inning. Leading off the inning, Daniel Vogelback as they'll look to get something going. Here and even this game up. Number 20. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. Now a swing and a miss. Oh Took something God. off that one and it's strike one. Hey, this guy's got an 89 mile an hour changeup. There was a time when 89 was a pretty good fastball. One ball and one strike to the Giants' first baseman. On the ground and right at the shifted infielders. And a good effort on the dive that time, but this will get by him for a base hit. That is it. The third baseman, Evan Longoria. In is the third baseman, Evan Longoria. As the first pitch to him is taken low and away for ball one. Ball and a strike. Two balls and a strike to Longoria. Hey, after those two breaking balls missed, you have to be sitting on a fastball right here. In front of the changeup, and he can't keep it fair. Two strikes on him now. Swung on and missed. Really fooled him that time for the first out. So in now for San Francisco. Brandon Belt. First delivery to him on the way. Smoked on the ground up the middle. To Frazier at the bag. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. Riding into the box, Jacob Stallings. The catcher, Jacob Stallings. Now the pitch. Swing and a miss, and he's behind 0-1. Oh, Here's one that misses high. It's 1-1. One
This is popped up, and this will be taken in by Longoria for the first down. One away now in the Pittsburgh third, and into bat next, the speedy Gerard Dyson. First pitch on its way. Swing and a miss, 0 and 1. Good fastball as he gets the swing and a miss. This pitcher's bringing it with some high velo. You better get that front foot down early and get ready, or he's going to throw it right by you. Now a swing and a miss here as he's down on strikes. So it's two up, two down to begin the third. Stepping up to the plate, Brian Reynolds. He reached on a single in his first try. Now the pitch. Swung right over the splitter there, 0 and 1. Two out, nobody on. Oh, and he's finding his groove out there now. It's 0 and 2. After that off balance swing right there, you find yourself down 0-2 and wishing you were back on deck with the donut on your bat, visualizing hitting a home run. And he'll try and tempt him with one of the dirt, but he'll hold back here. It's one and two. Got him looking, and that ends the inning. Bottom of the inning now, and that brings up Buster Posey. Here comes the first pitch. Posey is considered one of the best defensive catchers in the game today. He often gets praise for his work behind the plate, and I know a lot of pitchers have made it clear that his presence back there adds a level of comfort that not many others can replicate. And, Matty, I don't know if he's always going to be a favorite for the gold glove, but you walk around this clubhouse, you hear these pitchers rave about throwing That's to this guy. Club. That's all I need to hear. Right Here's the first pitch to him. And that misses ball one. Right side. Bell picks it up. And he is out on the tag. So bases are empty here with two gone. And up next, the utility man, Wilmer Flores. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. Out in front of a fastball as this is ripped down the left field line. That's going to be a fair ball. Running hard. He's digging for second. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. Now batter. The right field. In now, Hunter Pence as he grounds one briskly to short. He's got it. And nothing will come of the two out double as the inning is over. New inning set to get underway, and that'll bring in the second baseman, Kevin Newman. Kevin Newman. First pitch coming, here it is. Well behind that fastball, it's a swinging strike. I'd like to see this lineup start working the count a little bit more and drive up this pitcher's pitch count. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. He is in complete command out on the mound today. He's got all four corners locked in, and now he's raising eye levels to boot. Grounded back up the middle. A dive, but he can't knock it down. It's through for a base hit. The left fielder, number 25, Gregory. Into the box now, Gregory Polanco. As he takes a cold strike at the knees, it's 0-1. Line to the right side. 
but he will come on strong out there in right and pull this one down for the first down. So one gone in the inning here with the runner at first. And digging into bat next, the big bat of Josh Bell. He's set. Here it comes. Now a good pitch around the knees, but it doesn't quite catch the bottom of the zone. Don't be shocked if he doesn't go right back to that splitter again. He's looking for a double play, and that pitch certainly has enough depth on it to get him a ground ball. Fly ball out toward left center field. Yastrzemski will range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the second out of the inning. Into the box now, Trey Mancini. And he's off to a hot start in this one. Homered his first time around. And that's been the entire offense so far in this one. They've been shut down other than that. Starts him with a good rising fastball there for strike one. He got a swing and a miss on that last pitch, but that's not the location he wants to live in against a hitter of this quality. Well, had him reaching at thin air that time, and he's very quickly down 0 and 2. I know that feeling. Played 14 years in the big leagues and still can't hit a slider. And he chased it in the dirt. The throw to first is in time, and the inning is over. Settling in now, Mike Yastrzemski. And recall he doubled his first time through, but was thrown out trying to stretch that into a triple. Now here's the pitch. Hit softly down the line at first, but this will get foul for strike two. Wind up and the 0-2 pitch. Swing and a liner toward the gap in left center. Polanco will range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the first down. Mitch Hanniger the next to bat. Hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. Yeah, Matty, it's always a little frustrating when you square one up. You hit a solid line drive like he did, and all you have to show for it is a jog back to the dugout. That can get your head for a little while. And that finds its way into center for a one-out base hit. Now that number 20. Dan Vogelbach is next. As he'll look at a breaking ball that misses for ball one. One for one after a single this first time up. A ball and a strike. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Now the 2 1. Grounded to first. To Frazier at the bag. To first, and it's another double play. They're second in the first four innings as that one will retire the side. All ready to go in the top of the fifth, and that means Jonathan Scope will get ready at the plate. Jonathan Here comes the first pitch. Shocked he didn't let it fly right there. Usually you're looking for a fastball elevated to get the party started. Now the 0 1. And he gets him to swing through that one. He's in control 0 and 2. That one doesn't even sniff the zone, missing very high. Hey, if you're going to throw a pitch like that to this guy, that's right where you want to miss. Any lower, and he'll probably make you pay for it. The one two offering looked like a slider that time but it's two and two. Full count now three and two. Looked like he tried to elevate a fastball on that two two pitch there but kind of overdid it with a pitch that high. It's pretty easy to lay off if you're the hitter. 
Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. Toward the line in right. And this is going to be extra bases here to kick off the fifth. Not in time. And he's in there with a double. Now back. Adam and that'll bring in Adam Frazier as he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty it's strike one comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game good swing there but this is fouled off to the right side the 0 2 delivery Oh, a fastball swung on and missed, and for the second time today, he's gone on strikes. Now back. Jacob Stallings will be the next hitter. He popped out in his first trip. From the belt, kicks and deals. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Back goes Yastrzemski. He gets there, and that's the second out. The relay. Throw back to second, and that's a double play. Set now for the bottom of the fifth. And standing in is the veteran third baseman, Evan Longoria. First pitch coming. Here it is. Hard ground ball to third. And a reach to his backhand, but he can't come up with it. And the leadoff man's aboard. Here's the first baseman, Brandon Bell. He's 0 for 1 thus far. From the stretch. And he fouls this one off. Hits are now even at four apiece. Now a change up in on the hands that evens it at one and one. And a breaking ball in the dirt that time for a ball. A little early and now it's even at two and two. From the belt, the pitch. Hit out towards second. Newman fields it cleanly. To second for one. Relay to first and belt is gone. It's a double play. So base is empty now after the double play. And next to hit is the catcher, Buster Posey. First delivery to him on the way. Line drive to center field. Reynolds has it for out number three. Here's Gerard Dyson. He'll lead things off here in the Pirates' half of the sixth. The right fielder, number two. Gerard Dyson. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. Pence has a read on it. Looks it into his glove. And there's one gone. Ready once again. Brian Reynolds. One for two on his line so far in the game. Here comes the first pitch. All one's the count. The wind up and the 0-1. Lays off the slider and it's one and one. Line to the right side and Reynolds has himself a base hit. Up next to the fire, the second baseman, Kevin. Standing in now, Kevin Newman. As he'll take a look at a pitch too low, it's ball one. A hit and two tries for him so far. And he fires in a strike this time to make it one ball and one strike. And 
and this is taken for a called strike and he's not in love with that call either it's one and two now little chopper back to the mound to Crawford for one return throw is in time how about that they do turn two and it gets him out of the inning So stepping in, Brandon Crawford, as he'll get things started in the sixth for the Giants. That's your top. Brandon Crawford. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Oh, one count. Here's the pitch. His command has been outstanding so far, hitting nearly all of his spots, and that's been a big factor why he's been so successful up to this point. Oh, and two pitches, a curveball that misses one and two. He didn't look overly fooled right there because a lot of pitchers will go to the breaking stuff 0 oh 2, but he certainly looked ready for a breaker on that pitch. Late on that one as it's fouled off to the left side. Two balls and two strikes to Crawford. The 2-2. Two -two. This is pulled into right, and that'll get down a leadoff single for Crawford. And they're going to hold him to a single here as they do a nice job of getting it back in quickly. The battle, the second baseman, Wilmer. Wilmer. To the plate now, Wilmer Flores. Lined hard to center field. Reynolds is under it to make the play on the first down. So a runner at first the now with field. one away. And that brings in the outfielder, Hunter, Hunter Pence. From the stretch. Swung on and missed. It's 0 and 1. Off speed pitch in the dirt as he takes it for a ball. Hits are even right now at five aside. Back up the middle and in for a base hit. Long throw to third. And he's safe. The left number five. Mike. At the plate, Mike Yastrzemski, as he's well in front of the curveball and comes up empty there for strike one. Well, he's having a good amount of success here, Dan, even though he hasn't really gotten a ton of swings and misses. Yeah, but for him, Matt, he's more of a pitch-to-contact kind of guy, and obviously it's working so far, and the way he pitches, it really keeps his pitch count down. Catch is made here in right, and here comes the runner from third. And the run will score on the sacrifice fly as that'll square things at one-to-one. Now -one. Digging in and looking for more, Mitch Hanniger will try to bring in that second run of the inning from third with two down. Here's the first pitch to him. High in the air and deep to straightaway left. Back goes Polanco, and he brings it down to end the inning as the go-ahead run is left stranded. Seventh inning ready to roll. And coming forward, the veteran outfielder, Gregory Polanco. Gregory Polanco. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Ball one. Oh, 
swung on and belted to right by Polanco. This one's deep. Into the cove and gone. Up next to the party. The first base. Trevor Cahill comes on now, and he'll take over with nobody out in inning number seven. Number 53, Trevor Cahill. Josh Bell the next to hit. As the first pitch to him runs a bit inside for ball one. He's hitless in his two at-bats so far. Goes the other way with it as this is in the air down the line in left. Yastrzemski's got it and there's one gone. So here's Trey Mancini. He comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. Here comes the first pitch. And this is low ball one. Two runs six hits and one error in the contest for the Pirates so far. Here's a bouncing ball headed for Crawford at short scooped up. And he will beat the throw to first as the throw is high regardless and I believe that will be scored as an infield single. Here's Jonathan Scope now as he'll go after a hard sinker that time and falls behind nothing in one. He's working on a one for two game so far. Ground ball left side. A dive but he can't get a glove on it. It's through for a base hit. Now batting the shortstop, Adam Frazier. Stepping in now, Adam Frazier, as he'll pop this one foul off to the left and out of play. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. Left side, but well foul. From the stretch. A swing, and he pops him up on the infield, and the infield fly rule will be in effect here. Now batting, Jacob Stallings. He was a double play victim last time around. Looking to keep this a one run game, the pitch. Way behind that pitch, it's 0 and 1. And this misses the outside corner, so it's knotted up at 1 and 1. You know he's probably cheating on that inside pitch after he got jammed earlier. If you're on the mound right now, you want to try to hit that outside corner, and there's a pretty good chance you'll get him to roll over something. From the stretch, the one two. Swing and a miss at one in the dirt. And the throw to first ends the inning. <laughs> Leading off the inning, Daniel Vogelback. And they'll need him to get something going here. The designated hitter, number 20. First offering on its way. Swing and a miss on a ball in his eyes. One strike. Even though we're late into this ball game, this guy's veal is still top notch. This guy's a horse. Grounded up the first baseline. Bell scoops it up and he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Stepping into the box, Evan Longoria. No hits and two trips to the plate for him in the ball game. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Down the line and fair. That's a hit. And now it'll kick around in the corner. Now that the first baseman, Brandon. So now to the plate, Brandon Belt. He swings and lines it to left, but pretty much right at the left fielder as he takes it in for the second out. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. 
So it's a runner at first with two men out, and that'll bring up the former World Series champ, MVP, and Rookie of the Year, Buster Posey. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Line drive to center field. That gets down, and the inning will continue. The tying run comes all the way around from first to score. The batter number 35, shortstop, Brandon Crawford. Brandon Crawford digging in next. He swings and grounds it to short. On to first, and this will remain a tie ball game as the inning is over. Ready to begin the eighth, and that'll bring forth the veteran outfielder, Gerard Dyson. Gerard Dyson. Now time is called here as we'll get a trip to the mound. Pitch on the way. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. Waved at and missed, and he's behind 0-2. Did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate, and he'll have another shot at it here. The next 0 2 is a swing and a miss. That's strike three. Ready for another shot now. Brian Reynolds. He's two for three thus far. Reynolds. Tony Watson gets the call as he'll pitch with one gun in the top of the eighth. Number 56. Tony Watson. Here comes the first pitch. Good slider there. Gets a swing and miss. A shot down the first baseline. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Into the box, Kevin Newman. He's working on a one for three thus far. He's set and the pitch. Comes set, the 0-1. Swing and a ball in line down in the left field corner. But this will be foul. Hard sinker misses two and two. And he chased one there as this is bounced to short. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as this side is retired. Now at the plate, Wilmer Flores. One for two with a double on his line thus far. First pitch on its way. A shot to second base and handled for the first out. One gone here in the Giants half of the eighth and that'll bring in the right fielder Hunter Pence. Here's the first pitch to him. Hey this one's tied late in the game as a pitcher right now you just can't lay a cookie in there one and oh. Pitch on the way. 
Line hard to the left side. But this is a foul ball. Here's the one and one pitch. Count is one and two now. Breaking ball that time that misses out of the zone. Back to back sliders in on the hands. He didn't handle it real well at all in the previous pitch, so why not come right back with it again? Better job of laying off that one, though. And that is going to sneak on through into right. It's a one out single. The left field, number five. Mike. Billy Hamilton will be summoned now to be the pinch runner. Now running third for the Giants. Double zero. Billy Hamilton. Before the delivery, a check on that go-ahead run at first. And he'll get back in standing. Into the box now, Mike Yastrzemski. And this one's in the dirt, in time, as he just gets the tag down. That evens it up, one and one. Two and one. Tried to crush that ball and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. Even a two and two. The pitch. Well hit, but right into the teeth of the shift. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. All set to start the ninth in this one. And standing in is the veteran outfielder, Gregory Polanco. Yeah, man, this guy flexed his muscles in that last at bat. We heard that he has good power. That last bomb had to go well over 400 feet. He hit it a long way. Becomes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. And we kick off the ninth inning with a swinging strike here. Nothing in one. There's a ball ripped toward the gap in left center. Polanco around first, heading for second now. And your go-ahead run is in at second base here with a leadoff double. The first base. Now time is called as both guys in the bullpen are ready to go. Reyes Maranta comes on now and he's just hoping to keep this thing tied. No save opportunity here. So that'll bring up Josh Bell as he will look at a first pitch fastball for ball one. He's hitless in three at bats to this point. Count of one and one to the Pirates' first baseman. Oh, 
It's two balls and a strike to Josh Bell. Just behind the fastball there, two strikes now. We're going to see him throw that hard fastball early and often. Full count, three and two. When you're playing close games like this, base runners mean everything, so he can ill afford to start giving away free passes. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. Ready with another two-strike offering. Lifted the other way down the left field line. And that will end up a foul ball. Inside as he nearly got him, and it's ball four. And he is in there at third as the possible go-ahead score. And here's the big right-handed power threat, Trey Mancini. He has the possible go-ahead run only 90 feet away at third base. And here's indication from the dugout of an intentional pass, and that will load the bases here and set up the force at the plate. Here's the first pitch. And he'll hold off on the slider here to start the at-bat. It's ball one. A ball and a strike. The offensive approach here is simple. You know the pitcher's going for the K, so set your sights middle of the plate. And then don't worry about the infielders. They're so close, hard contact is a guaranteed win. One and two now. Needs a punch out here. Can he get it? Not just yet. It's ball two. Yeah, and if you get a guy flailing at a pitch like that, heck, you're going to go out there and throw that same pitch until he proves he can lay off of it. And it looked like the fastball got away from him there. Props to the hitter right there for laying off with a guy on third. You want to be aggressive, but you have to get a pitch you can drive. A bouncer up the middle. He'll come to the plate with it. They get the force at the plate. Relay to first is too late, so no double play, but no run scores. So striding in, Adam Frazier. And a pivotal moment in this one. Tie ball game, bases loaded, but the possibility of an inning-ending double play does still exist here. Here's the first pitch. Bases are loaded here, one man out. Swing and a fly ball, but shallow. And that's not going to do it. And he has delivered one of the biggest at-bats of the afternoon as he cashes in with a base hit. They get the force at the plate. So a big spot here in stepping in, Jacob Stallings, as he'll hit with the go-ahead run at third and two away. Here's the first pitch. Now a big fastball, and he's well behind it with the swing. Woo-wee! That was some smoke right there. High fire right on by. Here's one that misses high. It's one and one. Bases are loaded here. Two down. A ball and two strikes now. Definitely a big pitch coming up right here. He's going to be pumped if he can work his way out of this inning with the game still tied. Fouled away. One and two. Here it is. One two offering looked like a slider that time, but it's two and two. Just off the end of the bat, it's a foul ball, and he'll stick around. And he's 
strikes him out on a good pitch. So one run can win it as we head to the bottom of the inning. In now, Mitch Hanniger. He's got a Mitch hit in three at bats to this point. The right fielder, Mitch. Ready with Hanniger. the first pitch. Here it comes. The wind up and the 0 1. This one's down to third. Taken in by Scope. And he's retired here, one away. So now it'll be the four hole hitter Daniel Vogelback. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. First pitch coming here it is. The 0 1 on its way. Ah, he just ramps up and hears the fastball by him 0 and 2. And the slider gets him swinging to God. Now to the plate, Evan Longoria. He's working on a one for three thus far. First offering on its way. Swing and a miss that time. It's 0 and 1. Bases are empty here with two men out. Longoria swings right through that one as he's behind 0-2 now. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. Hey, that 0-2 fastball wasn't even close, but on hit right now, I'm still sitting on that heater. Waved at and missed for the third out. Not much of a chance at hitting that one, and the inning is over. We are into extra innings and standing in the outfielder, Gerard Dyson. First pitch on its way. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. Henniger is there. One pitch, one out. Now back to the top of the lineup, stepping in, Brian Reynolds. A couple of singles for him in four trips for him this afternoon. He's set. Here it comes. Line toward right center. And this is going to find Triples Alley out here in right center for extra bases. Around second now and headed for third. Reynolds heads for the plate. Now the relay home. And he will scramble back to third, but get there safely. Now back, second base, Kevin. Moore. Dan Altavia, the 5'11 right-handed reliever, enters to take over on the mound now. Number 53, Dan Altavilla. Standing in now, Kevin Newman. In the dirt and block behind the plate. And the slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. Boy, this is a dicey situation right here, D, where what the runner in scoring position, the sack fly brings that run in. This is where you're going to really have to try to keep the ball on the ground as a pitcher. What do you want to do as a hitter? And he has just given them the lead late as this is down for extra bases. Throw won't get him. At the plate now, Gregory Polanco. That's yes, the first pitch to him is a changeup that can't find the zone. It's ball one. A ball and a strike now. Nope. 
And that misses two and one. Runner at second here with one man out. And a half swing here, but this is in there for a cold strike two. Pulled toward right center field. After it is Hamilton. But it's the right fielder that gets there to make the catch. And there are two gone now. Next to bat will be the Pittsburgh cleanup batter, Josh Bell. Runner in scoring position with two gone. First pitch coming, here it is. Check swing, but he held up in time. Ball one. Two out here and a runner at second. Two balls and no strikes. Ready with the 2 0. This is a spot you like to be in as a good hitter. Runners in scoring position and count leverage in your favor. That one's in there, 3 and 1. Great job on those last two pitches of varying speeds. Gave him a hard fastball and then he locked him up with a changeup. There's ball four. But the plate now for Pittsburgh is the DH, Trey Mancini. Perhaps he can drive another one out of the park just like he did back in the second. Getting a few steps off a second there, now the pitch. Ooh, he's really in trouble, and it's just getting worse and worse and worse. This guy needs to find the strike zone in the worst way. In there, and it's even at one. It's one and two. He's looking pretty passive here, hitting with a chance to drive in a run. Going to have to make something happen with two strikes now. And he strikes him out here for out number three, but the damage has been done as now they'll need some extra inning heroic. Next to bat for the Giants, Brandon Belt. He could really use a knock here, 0 for 3 in the game so far. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Fastball well outside. Now the 1 0. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Polanco has a read on it, and he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Here's Buster Posey now. The catcher, Buster Posey. From the stretch, pitch is popped up. Newman over to his right, two gone. Here's the shortstop, the Brandon Crawford. Shortstop, Brandon Crawford. Now here it comes. One out. Two out, nobody on. A swing and a ground ball to third. On to first, and that'll be a bitter pill to swallow for this home crowd as the ball game is over. A one-run game this afternoon, 3-2 to two, the final finish. Here now is our final line score this afternoon. First for the victorious Pirates, three runs, 11 hits, one error.